Day four, the halfway point. The Wednesday of our week. Uh -huh. Yes, I win. This isn't fair, Niku. What did you suddenly become a tin pin expert? And why should I answer that? How about because I'm asking you? Have you been secretly training? Maybe. Look, a win's a win. That means we wait another hour for the mission. Niku, cut me a little slack. Not happening. I won. Therefore, we wait. But this is a huge waste of time. Hello? This is getting dumb. Keep it up. He's bound to crack. Today's 14... Today, 14 players were erased, sir. Leave it to a genius. At this rate, the game won't last the week. About that, sir. No missions have been issued in the last two days. None. None, sir. Nevertheless, players have been disappearing at a startling rate. And Minami Moto. Hey, well, he broke off contact yesterday. Our Game Master's gone missing. His so-called works of art have been sighted around the UG. Thus, I suspect he is still in the area. Then well, let's leave him be for now. Meaning you won't require an inquiry into Minamimo Minami Moto's activities? Correct. He's not a social animal. Give the man space. Understood. As you wish, Mr. Kidanichi. Any other problems? Several Reapers were attacked on Route 5, sir. We suspect taboo noise. Taboo noise? How does this affect our manpower? The losses are within tolerances. I've already set about identifying and locating the perpetrator. Very good. So the noise explained the dwindling player count. Yes, sir. I'm looking into any correlation between the two incidents now. Perfect. I'd expect no less. I'll leave it to you, Konishi. Understood, sir. Show Minami Moto. A true genius. Youngest Reaper officer in history. Tactics, intel, willpower, decisiveness, performance. His numbers are just short, Mr. Kidanichi's. Except for cooperation, a whopping zero. I'll admit he has talent, but his quirks are beyond control. What is he after? My analysis suggests. How can you be busy, Mr. H? Your cafe is always empty. Tell me who you Fine, are fine, sorry. Later. Fifteen minutes of counting. I need to now heal. Say, Nigga, could you do me one teensy favor? I don't care about Bingo. But me. Now to be the punch. If this is about the weight, I'm not listening. Right. Fine. How about a trade? Right on cue. Okay, answer my question and I'll go with you. You twist my arm, go on and shoot. What are you after? You're curious? If you don't feel like talking, we can wait. It's nothing major. I'm going to Jack Shibuya. Right, how about a real answer? That was a real answer. So how do you jack a town? That's why I'm looking for the Shibuya River. What Shibuya River? My turn to ask a question. Do you really want a second chance? What's waiting for you in the RG? You're as alone there as here. What's the difference? You don't have to answer. I don't really care. Now, let's get started. How's our signal today? It's coming out from out past Shibu Q heads. That puts it out near Udugawa. Right. You know the city of all Neku. Shibuya born and raised. My my. It's coming from Udugawa, right? Let's go. Who? Hmm? Well, this is new. Someone's a eager beaver today. The Udugawa district. Same place I saw in your head. Along with me, lying dead on the ground. How'd I die? And who the hell are you? I might find my answers there. See, I'm going to... Well, let's see. Are the taboo here attacking yet? There'll be a blue noise that charges at you. So yeah. I'm going to put a break here, and we will pick up here in a little bit from your perspective. It's just the way this is all set up, it's kind of confusing. So I'll see you guys in a sec. Okay, so picking up where we left off at. 
Like, this black screen always concerns me. I'm afraid the game froze or something. Signals coming from Ubigawa? Right up center street past Tipsy Toes Hall. Ubigawa? What happened to me there? So, real quick... You guys are probably tired of this from the last video, but I'm gonna cash out real quick. Um, I made a deck of the pennies. These... Well, I'll show you guys. In the meantime, we want to cash out six of these. By the way, I don't recommend starting this game from sleep mode because I had to recalibrate everything. We need to go to the 10-4 building because there should be... Is it here? Hi there! No, that's not Come it. back soon! There should be a new pin slot up for grabs in one of the stores. Just, I'm not sure which one. Come on in. Thanks a bunch. Come on in. Well, grab that for Shiki. Thanks a bunch. Welcome. Here we are. So real quick, what does this actually cost us? Two Scarletite. Totally worth it, man. That's an extra pin slot. So we can pack one more goodie in battle. Otherwise, if you want, you can look around to some of this. That's a lot of hit points, man. This is also a lot of defense. So we'll grab these and be on our way. Till next time. Good day. Hello. Uh huh. So he gave us the tip for the mid polo. Pick up the mousey sweatshirt. So I don't know if we we're supposed to buy pins Thank or you. what exactly. As for the burger shop. Welcome to sunshine. I ate some of this stuff off camera. Okay, I have the fries. Thanks, come again. So yes, we literally did just walk in there, order some French fries, and be on our way. A East. That's La Pan Angelique. One of the things I'm kinda of looking around for are pig noise. If you don't pick them up during the main game, you can't get them during the post game. Check it out. Mr. Grom is shut down until week three. I don't know if he has anything new. Instant noodles. Thank you. Yeah, we're on pretty good terms with the old geezer, so we don't need to buy anything. This takes us back to 10 4. It's entirely possible that the pig may not appear until a little bit later. What are we here? Well, it's a reaper. What's up, players? Want me to clear the wall? Let's see. Clear this area of five. No, six noise levels. No. Ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho. Make it ten. Beat ten of them. You do that and we'll talk. So, in case you're wondering, yes, I'm gonna do that, but I'm gonna do that off camera to spare you guys. Plus, I need to reconfigure some of my pins. See you in a sec. Okay, a whole bunch of noise got butchered, but I don't know if it counts, because there's only four noise here at any given time. Damn, man, didn't think you actually do it, so yeah, you're able to leave the screen and come back. All clear, so violent. Yeah, we get ten bucks for our trouble, as well as pretty ribbon to celebrate the bloodbath. What should I say? Commemorate. Yeah? So I was wondering if there was a pig here, but there is a ton of them. I don't know, maybe this area will be important later on in the chapter. Just to be honest, I don't remember too much about Joshua's because I kind of sped through when I played this in the DS version. Because I think in this version, beat is the strongest possible partner. So he doesn't open until later, apparently. Udagawa? I think 
that's over by Wildcat, isn't it? I'll pass this wall, bring me one sexy plus. It's a pin. Noise number 59, Scott. It's so much difficult to use. It's noise 59. I haven't found it too yet. It's a type of bird, though. So you know what? I will look around for the bird. See you in a second. Okay, I just butchered every noise here. I actually got the pin on my first try, it's just I wanted to be thorough. I don't even know what the sexy plus does offhand, in case you're wondering. I have more than one, buddy, don't worry. And they gave us 50 bucks for that. I'm gonna duck in here real quick. Hello! Attack and defense. Thank you. I'll pass. And another freaking Reaper. I'll pass this wall. Fight a four reduction chain battle. I don't care what area you fight it. If you don't fight four rounds, it won't count. Dude, I butchered like 16 noise in the previous area. Did you see that? Barely made that one in time. So we're just gonna speed through these. Watch yourself. We have a new crab type noise there. Ah, it's not activated yet. How's my aim? I can't. This right there is sushi. In case you wanted to see it, I picked that up using my Lord Chalcum. Stellar Flurry, that's supposed to be the type of thing you have to do to summon your team. You're when he's God. your teammate. And no, I don't really consider that a spoiler because I told you guys it was coming in the first video. Okay. I need to resend this. <laughs> This is a normal difficulty in case you're wondering. With that many kangaroos, I kind of wish it was hard so I could have gotten the 5,000 yen, uh, 5, yen badges. Okay, that's what I'm gonna call them. And right there, you got to see why I wanted the whole rebound in midair thing. What's up? Who's next? How's my what? In case you're wondering, the Stellar Flurry was a little bit better in the DS versions just because of uh, the touchscreen offering a little more control over it. And we'll have this guy at Seagull. Rest in peace. I'm working on evolving that pin, it's just... I'm not doing any sort of... Hey, we got live... Live slow, die fast. That was a nice I'm not doing any sort of clock manipulation. So real quick, we need to down some more ice cream. If you want to see my stats while we're on the screen. I namely give Neku the vanilla. Lock on him. Edible. And Joshua the Whatever doesn't kill me. Anyway, there you go, Reaper. I'll butcher the whole damn area if you don't get out of my way, you included. Hmm? Reaper alert. Let's just report it to the police. Um, hello, we're metal and reapers. No way, we lose all our cred. Like, you have any after boning this up? Sounds like an argument. Sounds like trouble we don't need. Let's ignore them. Let's strive. Oh, crud. No. No tin pin.
hold up, you two. Yeah. Busted. Huh? Wait, you're that... Hey, my man, I remember you. Perfect timing, you're not busy, right? Help a brother out. You'll hear me out? Rock. We're booked, right, Neku? Sorry, but we have somewhere to be. Right, Udagawa. What? Yo, Tenho! On it. What? A wall? Hey! You wanna get through here? Help us out. <sighs> Thrusting your personal problems on players? How very professional. I didn't want to... I hate how these stores have angled entranceways. <laughs> Another junk pile. The Grim Heaper strikes again. No one else who put together something like this? Mm. There's something written on it. Any sound can shake the air, but my voice shakes the heart. What? First of all, sounds don't really shake anything. I think he's saying he's better than air. Uh, huh. Trackers are spawning here, but I don't think it's what we're looking for. So what's the deal? Long story short, our band's microphone has gone missing. <sighs> Happened around 2 o'clock yesterday. We had a little gig at Mulco, right? Even, even unveiled a new track. Should have been no problem. But the show ends, we split for the day. I let our stuff out of my sight for one minute, tops. I get back and the mic's gone. Yeah, says you. You probably just left it someplace. I'm telling you, BJ, it was stolen. That thing is Def March's heart and soul. I wouldn't just lose it. Somebody took it. Who the hell would want a mic with wings? What? Hey, you lost it. Fine. Let's just split up and look for it, okay? Why are we looking for your junk? Screw that, man. You lost it, you find it. I'm out of here. Oh, Tenno. This your phone, bro? Oh, snap. Found it lying around. Thanks, man. I was wigging out trying to find it. Where was it? And, I mean... Spain Hill! I'm heading back to AE East. Later. I'll go look around Mulco again. Thanks. I still don't see how this is our problem. Come on. Look, I'll pay ya. Help us out. No way, we're... Here, let me pay you before I forget. Punk beat me to the draw. Hundred bucks. Two hundred bucks. Three. Three hundred and five. Anyway, that five is actually kind of important, because a lot of places will barter for that. Step one is gathering info with... Starting with a client. Honestly, Neku, this is basic stuff. Yoshia Kiryu, private dick extraordinaire. Okay, so we have to talk to him again. Hey, but why does get cracking? Can you give us a little more to go on? Sure. What do you need to know? The mic. Describe the stolen microphone. It's a stand mic with black wings. Black wings? Yeah, it's the band symbol. Who want a bat mic? I can think of one guy. Really? Who? Freaking BJ. BJ? The guy in the black hoodie was just here. He's been whining about wanting to do vocals. We had it out over that yesterday. Said he wanted his share of the glory. Mike went missing right after that. Wait, he stole it because... He wanted to be a vocalist? That makes no sense. What happened when the mic was taken? I actually didn't tell the other guys, but... Just before it disappeared, I got a call. A phone call? Yeah, thinking back now, it's pretty shady. Why was the call shady? They didn't give their name. Just meet me by Kadoi City. We need to talk. Any guesses? Not really. Caller ID said it was a public phone. You sound like an affected voice, too. So, did you go? Yeah, but no one was there. When I got back to Mulco, the mic was gone. That is shady. So someone called to lure you away. And you think the Reaper in black you were fighting with? He 
PJ, was it? You suspect him. As much as I hate to consider it. And that's all, folks. Good luck, guys. I'll be right here. What a pain. So, what now? Well, it's obvious, isn't it? We investigate the crime scene and question the people involved. What, have you done this before? So we've got Molko and the two bandmates. Let's get started. So I thought the microphone theft happened a little later. Hmm? Isn't that... Let's see what he has to say. Any luck finding the mic? I'd like to ask you a few questions. Sure, whatever. Triple Seven said the mic was the band's soul. What makes it so special? It just is. Back when we were still busking out on the streets, we pooled our, all our money to buy it. It's the symbol of our band, our bond as a band, as friends. I stuck wings on it to remind us of that. It got us through some tough, some rough times. I see. Well, lately, Triple Seven and BJ have been fighting over who gets to sing, over who has rights to the mic. Talk about irony. You must be happy then. The object of them is out of the picture. Yeah. But not that happy, I just... Never mind. Got an alibi? Where were you yesterday at 2 o'clock? Right here? Are you asking us or telling us? Ah, yes. BJ said he found your phone on Spain Hill. Oh, yeah. Must have dropped it here. Well, I don't see our mic here. I'm going back to wait with Triple Seven. You've been very helpful. So I know where he actually was. <laughs> he said the mic went missing at Mulco, right? Look, a phone booth. Right, Triple Seven said the call came from a payphone. Then let's... Hey there. Huh? Aren't you, like, players? And you two are... Ah, yes, the winners of the slam-off. You, like, remember us? Super yay! You need something? So, like, I'm always with the same guy. I want to talk to somebody else for a change. And most folks can't, like, see us, so... What are your names? I'm Joshua, this is Neku. Nice meeting you, Neku, J-Dog. I'm Soda. The cute one's now. Call me now, now for short, okay? Uh, sure. Hey, did you guys know? No missions yesterday or today. The players are still getting wiped out. Wiped out. You should be very careful, Nike. Nike? You saw some real scary noise before. We ran like bunnies. You should, like, totally run if you see him. Let's just all stay sharp and get through this together, huh? Yeah. Did you know? Hey, man, don't. Even if multiple players survive, only so many get to come back to life. What? Like, uncool? The other players aren't your friends. They're your competition. That goes for partners, too. No way. If, like, two people survive, and only one gets to go back, what happens to the other one? They play again, same as Nike here. Whoa, like, this is your second time? Yeah. Then your partner made it back. No, she didn't. I don't get it. She was taken as my entry fee. No way. That's, like, super cool. I chose to play again, and she... It's my fault she didn't make it back. No worries, man. Huh? She was your entry fee, yeah? That means you really care about her. No reason to feel guilty for that. Yeah, it's like, totally not your fault. I'd gladly be so does entry fee if it gave him another chance. And I'd play the game a million times from now. Whatever it takes to get us, back both, get us both back to the RG dog. You don't think I'm to blame? Forget blame, man. Plus, I don't care if only one of us gets a second chance. I still ain't sniping other players. Like, yeah, fighting isn't the answer. We don't want to be alive again. Nobody deserves it most, right? I want you to win too, Nikki. It's so, like, this is for you. A pin. Yeah, we like, won out of the slam off. And now it's yours. You sure? We couldn't use it. Not that we're dumping our trash on you, but... Anyway, give it a try. Thanks. We should probably move on, yeah? Be safe, Nikki. Bye, Josh Josh. Like, see you later? They were charming. Don't they 
deserves it most. That's true. Everybody's got their own deal. Their own dreams. None of them outpace the next. Shibuya is full of all kinds of folks, huh? <laughs> Talk about your non sequurs Sorry. So, how about we check out that phone? So now we have the hero pin. Scratch empty space to activate the pin psych. I wanted to see if there was any taboo here. Nothing's flying at me. But there is a pig noise here. Your good is gone! The whole gimmick there is that it's invisible. That was a nice distraction. As long as you shoot where you last saw it, you can mow the sucker down. No microphones here. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Triple Seven said the call came from a payphone. Is this the one? This looks like a job for my phone. Huh? What the tracker? No, the other new feature. What other new feature? The camera. Don't most phones already have a camera? Watch and learn. I simply set the time to yesterday and... Watch and learn what? It's a photo. Let's try a different time. Huh. So it was right here at this time yesterday. Hide your phone. Weren't you listening to Mr. H? He had a couple of new features. One's the tracker, the other's the camera. It takes photos of the past. Holy. That's Mr. H's work? Who the hell is he? So, could you shift the time later to see who took it? Let's try. That's BJ, right? Huh? The mic's gone. Very suspicious. Let's just take one more just to be can't, huh? There's a three shot per day limit. What? Why? How should I know? Ask Mr. H. Suddenly it's a lot less impressive. Then we'll use mine. Mm. Huh? Something wrong? My phone has no camera. <sighs> you must have forgotten to do yours. So let's just tell you to go after BJ again and what? What's up, dude? What he has to say. Ahem. What? Weren't you headed back to A East? I wanted to lose myself in the crowd for a bit. You know, can't say that I do, actually. I just had a few questions for you. Look, what do you want? About the stolen mic. Stolen? Triple Seven's full of it. I'm sure he just left it someplace. Either way, he should have been watching our stuff. I knew you wanted that mic for yourself. So what if I did? It doesn't matter now. I don't need it anyway. Where were you yesterday at 2 o'clock? Oh, uh, I was... You know, uh... Dogenzaka, yeah. In line for the new ramen place. Why would I go to the phone booth by Volko? No, it's there. What? Just give me some space, would you? I want to spend some time alone. Of course, but first, take a look at this photo. What? Huh? That's the phone booth near Molko. AKA the phone booth of love, right? 
Isn't there some kind of urban legend? They say if you use this phone to confess your love, the other person will love you back. I don't know who you called, but you were there yesterday, that much is fact. But I... you weren't in Dogenzaka. You were chaining up some tramp near Mulko. She's not a tramp! Damn, Josh, remind me not to take you off. You can't tell anyone about this. Okay, so I was there yesterday. I made a call. Are you happy now? Quite. You've been helpful. Thanks. I'm gonna head back to see Triple Seven. Well, please find the stupid mic by now. Seriously, if you tell a soul, you're dead. I don't think we're getting anything else on. Let's move on. Feeling pinned. Break down those boundaries, Tell Red me Skull. Who you are, mm. who you were, how much have you been paid? Hey, it's that commercial. Look, it's plain. That cat pin is fat. You can't find that pin anywhere. It's really taken off. Even folks who seem like they wouldn't be into cat if I have them on, but they don't appreciate it at all. Like the guy handing them out in the ramen place. Looks like everybody has Red Skull fever. She and I were pretty thorough. Looks an awful lot like the player pin. So who makes the player pins anyway? The Reapers? Nope. That's the composer territory. He's responsible for creating and controlling them. The composer? The guy in charge of Shibuya? Correct. Or the composer's game. The Reapers are just his enforcers. They execute his designs. Some designer. This game morally sucks. <laughs> Doesn't it? Can he and his Reapers go to the RG? RG, UG, it's all the same, Shibuya. Just people in the RG can't see us here. We're like air to you, visible if they're real. People are only visible in shops and special decals. The Reapers can materialize at will. They're perfectly visible in the RG. Minus the wings, of course. So they have wings here, but not in the RG. Apparently a Reaper's wings house his power. So they're basically just normal people in the RG. Tell me who you are and who you were. Said, so the player pins only paid? exist in the UG. The composer makes them, and now the red skull pin. With a very similar design. Hell, it's freaking identical. Coincidence? Not likely. So what? Are they both just... No. They're made by the same person? Then that would make the composer... No way. Not Cat. Something wrong, Niku? No, I'm fine. So I don't know the fastest way back to the East. Oh, I was right. Okay, I'm not 100% sure on the trigger to move forward. We're going to talk to this guy at the scramble crossing. Black screen always concerns me. I've never trained these pins to get so big. I am good at this stuff. So that's the guy. The one who gave that promoter guy the pin job? Not that either one of them did any of the work. The trackers are spotting here, but that's what we're looking for. Okay, hopping over to the tool records area as the background might indicate. Look who. I've been looking forever and still nothing. Chill out, Uzuki. Stay steady, girl. Are you kidding? This is a direct order from Miss Konashi. Don't you blow my big chance to. Um. You again? You actually look busy today. Very busy, thank you. 
we certainly don't have any time to waste on you. Karia, we're leaving. Bye. Whatever. I wonder what they were looking for. Signals getting weak. Let's try someplace else. Strange. Yeah, what's up? You've got Niku's phone camera. Honestly, Mr. Strange. My bad. Can you add it now? I'm actually fresh out of parts. I guess I'll have to wait then. Next time, I promise. Let's just go, Niku. So there's all these little things here and there, and I don't know what it is that triggers the whole thing to go forward. Uh, Okay, going to Tipsy Toes Hall, as the thing on the top tells you. Well, if we haven't found it by now, it's probably not turning up. I'll go report it to the Poe. Not so fast, huh? I think I've identified your thief. You serious? Wait, what? Let's recap. The theft occurred yesterday at 2 o'clock. Triple Seven received a strange phone call. What phone call? Meet me by Kanoi City. We need to talk. The microphone was stolen while he was away. According to Triple Seven's caller ID, the call originated at a public phone. Care to know who placed it? We have conclusive proof. What? You guys aren't gonna. This photo shows. Neku? What? I'm telling them? This photo tells it all. So, it's the 2 o'clock one. Wait, BJ? I told you not to say anything! So, it was you who called me? Whoa there. When did you get that call? Precisely that is. Let me check. 140. Take a closer look at the photo. See, it was taken at 202. BJ used the phone, that much is fact. But he wasn't calling you. No, he was calling a lady friend. To whisper sweet nothings in her. Okay, okay, I admit. I told the chick I like her. And she completely blew me off. Happy now? Go ahead, laugh. Deep breath, Beach. This isn't the point of the photo. Look what's in BJ's left hand. Is that a cell phone? Certainly looks like it. But not BJ's. I don't get it. Look at this photo. Would you do the honors, Neku? The one of the mic? What about it? Ignore the microphone. Look on top of the telephone. It's that cell phone. Correct. It was there when BJ arrived. He saw it and took it. Well, why would he do that? Because it belonged to... Wait a minute! You knew the owner, so you picked it up and returned it. Tenno, is your phone bro? Oh snap, found it lying around. Thanks man, I was working out trying to find it. Where was it? Uh, in, I mean... Spain Hill! Tenno, but, but... DJ said he found the cell on Spain. Oh. DJ didn't want anyone finding out he got blown off, so he lied about where he found it. Well. I'd say this makes for an airtight case. Tenho left his cell on the phone room. The question is, why? I'm sorry, guys. It was all me. What? Why, my man? I thought it'd stop you two fighting. I don't want us to break up. So I just... Sorry, bro. We put you through a lot, huh? Yeah, my bad, Tenho. I on a line. I was out of line while wanting to do vocals. But that's all over now, right? We good again? 
I'm cool. Good. Now let's have that mic, Tino. It, uh... It kinda got stolen. What? I called 777 from that phone. Once he left, I grabbed the mic. I was on my way to go hide him. But 777, I saw you coming back. I freaked and hid in the phone booth. I was just gonna wait it out. Then you called me. The mic's been stolen, couldn't even buy Molko. So I stashed the mic in the phone booth. I must have left my phone in there too. I checked in with you, but when I went back, the mic was gone. Recognize the megaphone? Gone? Yeah. This was in there in its place. A megaphone? With some freaky stuff recorded in it. Sign! Cosine! Tangent! I'm sorry, guys. I just wanted us to stay together. Now, because of me. Megaphone could only belong to one person. Fascinating. It seems this mystery runs deeper. Care to enlighten them, Neku? Tell them who really took their mic. No brainer. The guy who took the mic is. None of the above. None of those guys. 140? Maybe Mike could always sit here. We need to talk. Hey! Who are you? Now's my chance. 150. Oh crap, triple seven. Gotta hide. Ooh. My phone. Hello, it's me, triple seven. We're boned. The mic's been ganked, bro. Hurry on back to Molko. Uh, be right there. Be right there, back, Mike. Stay put. Fifty-seven p.m. Huh? Why, hello. This mic is Zeta sexy. Perfect for my illness. Here, we'll call it a trade. Two o'clock. Okay, okay, let's do this. I'm gonna tell her. I'm gonna... Huh? That's ten no cell. What an airhead. Oh, well. Phone booth of love my <laughs> phone booth of love my ass. <laughs> Two ten. Now to pick up the. It's gone. What the hell is this megaphone? Great story. Now where's our mic? Hmm. Knowing him. In that junk heap over there. What? Our baby is in that pile of trash? Start digging, boys. Sorry to drag you guys into this. I cleared the wall. Go on, we'll manage from here. Best of luck. Now then, shall we head to Utagawa now, Neku? That was the detour from hell. You're not kidding, Neku. So... I need to have a... Okay, I wanted to clear their stomachs before moving forward. Gotcha, punks. Huh. Hope you brought your A-game today, yo. B, don't do this. I don't want to fight you. Begging won't work, yo. Look, I have to win for Shiki too. So would you please go away? Shut it. Let's just do this. What the hell? How's my aim? What the hell? Take this! Get out! Dumbass! Okay, the recording might be screwing up. Dumbass! Well, I'm Dumbass. a little concerned about... Dumbass! So the fight ends after like a minute. 
the recording just melted down there, so I don't know what all you're gonna see. Just know neither of us knocked the other out, just went on for the time limit. So when you survive this, you get the Joshua Attack sticker, you get Live Slow, Die Fast, that is a uh, Psychokinesis type hit. You get some Scarletide. That's about all I've got. No, <laughs> I had plenty to spare, man. Yo, 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 are you even trying? Hit harder. I barely felt that. Man, you all are stale. Next time, at least put up a fight. That was pretty close. Are you serious? I must really not like you. I can see him hating me. But why are you very she sheaky, too? Is he really all Reaper now? What's this thing? Come on. That was this was rhymes. You've seen it germination. He must have dropped it. I guess so. He's no genius. But he must have had a reason to join them. This meant a lot to him. I should return to cuddle with the sorrow, but how could I? Good day. Goes down six bytes. Here you go. These are the. They're extremely expensive, but so damn potent. <laughs> you have the HP tablets. Sync ray. This is your surge of bravery. So you can only use this for defense, I guess. I look forward to your next visit. Hello. That's just the defense one. Negativity, long-range attacks, positivity, and neutrality. Some foes are immune to certain affinities. Yeah, I'll give you a buck for that. And then he just has some random crap here. Thank you. Hello. Joshua's attack. Making his partner and the enemies are all simple negative statuses. I don't know if your partners can get the status effects. They used to be able to. I don't know if they still can. Yeah, I'll probably end up buying a bunch of components Thank you. here later to max out his friendship if I want it. Hello! So, this allows us a little more money. Yoink! Thank you! Sadly, I burned up a lot of my money on just miscellaneous clothes shopping. I'll actually pull this up so you can see it. Normally, I imagine you guys would dread this, but I'm being kinda low. So, you know, we will buy one set of. We'll buy two. I'll splurge. Good so, you heard it here fo first, folks. Drugs are the answer. So, now she sells the sink bar. Goes down one bike, gives you. Wow. I, I don't want to part with my 50s, visit. though. Because so I think you can get a fusion thing for Joshua there eventually. No Udagawa well, Niku? Yeah, I used to come here after school. With your friends. Please. I don't do groups. I never met anyone fun to be around. <laughs> Me neither. We seem to have a lot in common. You know, Neku, Shibuya is a lot like you. Cut off. Where did that come from? The UG is split into different areas. Shibuya is just one of them. Just like it's only one part of the world at large. Each UG area has unique rules. You can't travel between them. Mr. H told you all that? Oh, so you know about our conversations. As I was saying, every area has its own rules. They never meddle with each other. Sound familiar? That could apply to anyone. <laughs> Maybe so. As long as we have our own worlds, people will never understand each other. Right? They're then, and I'm me. Talking to them gets me nothing. I never thought I'd respect anyone. Until I saw Cat's mirror. They described a new philosophy. Do what you want. How you want. When you want. Was it? Yeah, blew me away. I was living the life I always wanted to, but never thought I could. I 
like someone who gets me, I thought. Enjoy the moments about freedom. I just need to do my own thing like that. Forget about other people and just enjoy my life. Absolutely. Who needs other people's values? It's easier to just live by your own rules. Yeah. But... I don't feel that way anymore. Since coming to the UG reads people's minds. Should we just fool people with just as many viewpoints? Mr. H said the world ends with me. To expand my world, I have to look farther. Not write off other people's values as inferior. Maybe I had it backwards. Maybe I need to open up to really enjoy... Yoo-hoo, Neku. We may be stuck in Shibuya, but you can still see a fair ways. Why do you suppose that is, Neku? Why show us what we can never reach? <laughs> that mural you mentioned is up ahead, right? The signal's coming from that direction. Let's take a look. The moment of truth, people. Sicko Records. Or is that supposed to be Psycho? See you again. His friendship must go up a lot as you buy stuff. Check it out, it's Pie Face. Three is the point of the one. Mm -hmm. Tell me who you are and who you were. How much have you been paid? Four. Take it the easy. one five -E nine or two. Would you like to have something to drink? To tell you the <gasps> truth in this country. Hey, it's I don't care about Shh. anything but me. Let's see what he's up to. Six five three five eight nine seven nine. You know, I'm 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 five, nine seven nine. Three two three eight four six two six four three. <laughs> and perfect. Soon, soon I'll have my desired solution. What was that all about? This is vandalism. He drew it just now, right? More of his loony art. I wonder. My phone's responding to it. To these scribbles? I thought you were looking for the Shibuya River. I am. I don't see any rivers. Thank you, Neku. But what is this? Considering the artist, it can't be anything good. Well, should we erase it? You'll know. Besides, it could be a trap. Let's leave it for now. Now's the best time. If I take him to where I was lying on the ground... Hey, say, Neku. What? I'd like to check over by that mural. Do you mind? Sure. And tell me who you are and who the you weasel beat me to it. What's he need over there? Finally. Deep breath, girl. Don't give me that. Why those two brats have to show up? They're so in the way. Why can't Math Man just let me erase them? Anyway, what the heck was the GM doing here? I'm thinking of missions not to give. Suzuki, get on the horn of the HQ. Now. What? Why? That's a taboo noise for fun, are you sigil? Huh? That? I never knew what they looked like. So the GM's gone maverick? This is the source of the taboo noise? Not quite. This sigil still hasn't been used. There must be another source. Still, we saw him draw it. That's pretty strong evidence he's behind it all. Do you smell that, Karya? Promotions. Glory. I'll pass. Instead of me buying that bowl of ramen, you can just take care of the report for me, I... Um... What, you're too lazy to even claim the credit? Something like that. <laughs> Besides, I may have another mystery to unravel. Wild boar. Hey, man. So you can get the skateboard... Sparkling silver and a camo deck. This is the camo deck. And I have a couple items already. Ooh, good call. See you again. Impressive graffiti. It's cats. This is my favorite spot. And the spot where I died in your head. Mm. Wait. I assume I was looking at your memories. Just been, couldn't it have just as easily been your imagination? 
What I saw doesn't prove anything. You could have had nothing to do with. Still with me, Neku? You spaced out. Sorry. You're giving me deja vu. Huh? What? Deja vu? From when? Did... Did you really see me die? Were those scans really of... Is that my death? I have to know for sure. One more scan. give me a dud. How could he act so normal around a guy he killed? He sought me out as a partner. Hell, why kill me at all? What did I do? Did he know me when I was alive? I didn't know him. Random homicidal impulse? He must have had a motive. Too many questions. One thing's for sure, though. I'm partner to my killer. What a way to end the day. Pinned closed. <laughs> 